I would like to share a few thoughts from Scripture on the compassion of Christ. We know that one day when we stand before the Lord at the white throne judgment seat, we are rewarded. Salvation is free. The gifts of the Holy Spirit are free. But what we do and strive to bear the fruit of the Holy Spirit, we will receive rewards and crowns. In my opinion, the greatest is the compassion of Christ. To have the compassion of Christ. We find in Psalm 86.15 But you, O Lord, are a compassionate and gracious God, slow to anger, abounding in love and faithfulness. Now what is compassion? I looked up in my concordance, literally suffering with another, having pity or sympathy for one another. In the revised version, to be merciful. Let's just look at a few scriptures in relation to Jesus. We find in Mark 1 verse 41 to 42 Filled with compassion, Jesus reached out his hand and touched the man. I'm willing, he said, be clean. Immediately the leprosy left him and he was cured. We also find in Luke 7 verse 13, when the Lord saw her, his heart went out to her and he said, don't cry. This is in relation to the widow whose son was raised from the dead. We find in Hebrews 10 verse 13 to 14 another aspect of compassion. You sympathize with them in prison, at other times you stood side by side with those who were so treated with insult and persecution. So in a nutshell, compassion is more than pity, is more than sympathy, it is a heartfelt feeling stirring you into action wanting to suffer with that person, standing side by side till the trauma is over. That is the compassion of Jesus. May we strive to have that compassion because God is a God of love, a God of compassion for the needs and hurts and scars and trauma and sorrow of mankind. Let us pray. Father, we thank you in Jesus' name for your compassion on mankind, for your love. We pray that you will fill us with the compassion of Jesus. Not just pity and sympathy, but a heartfelt feeling for mankind's sorrow and need to be moved into action so to speak, suffer with another and standing side by side till that trauma, the problem, the affliction is over. Fill us with the compassion of Jesus, I pray, in Jesus' name. Amen.